Greetings everyone and welcome to Miss Survival. Version 0.6, or should I say a test version of 0.6 because yeah, this is definitely a test version. It was released in Steam on the beta branch about two weeks ago. If you enter the code they give you, then you can have access to it. There's a lot of changes, a lot of changes. Uh, the first and the biggest one I would say would be the size of the world has increased. Essentially, they took the map from a couple of versions ago and attached it to the current map to make the world bigger. I think you go through a tunnel. I'm not quite sure about that, but I do believe I'm on the old map right now. And I do remember a couple of things about it, so I'm hoping to head to a specific location and that it is still there. Uh, the vehicle system has also changed. I mean, you still drive around, but it's how you fill it with fuel and how you actually build the vehicles. You have more options available to you, but we'll talk more about that when we run into a vehicle, which we probably won't have to wait too long on. So if you've never seen this game before, it's essentially a open world, post-apocalyptic zombie survival game. I know we don't have anywhere near enough of those, but how are we going to learn to survive when it actually happens if we don't play these games, right? And the big thing with this is the mist. So there was this terrible mist that descended and it turned people into flesh-eating creatures, right? Somehow it avoided me. I guess I had a bunker or something like that. However, I'm here. Didn't seem to affect the bandits either. Interesting how that worked out. Anyway, the zombies don't like sunlight. So you're not going to see them walking around. Uh, the only thing that can really get you is a bear because bears are godless killing machines. If you go into a building, there might be one there. But the thing you have to watch out for is if a mist falls during the day, then they can come out. In which case, you better get to uh, cover. Probably sleep it off is a good idea. Anyway, what we're going to do is we're going to play this because my viewers have asked me to play this. And we're going to traverse the minefield of bugs and hopefully have some fun with this. Hopefully we don't get anything game breaking that's really going to cause a lot of frustration. I have done some test playing and I have had some frustration, so I kind of know what to avoid. So let's just get going, right? All right, so first things first, this is where they start me. There is numerous different starting locations, but this is where they put me. This is the universal sign of shelter, but I'm not going to be using that. All right, so we got a box and we have a combat knife and we have a chocolate bar. All right, so I'm going to pick this up. Okay, there's another one. Hold on a minute. Put that down. And anything in there? No? All right, I'm just going to take this one with me then. All right, this is how you carry things now. Uh, for those who have previously watched this game, yes, carrying containers is how you do things. Why? Because this is my inventory right now. I mean, eventually I can unlock this. It used to be that you had to find backpacks to unlock slots. I don't know if that's the way it is now. I didn't find any. So, I mean, I don't know. Maybe there's none on this map yet. I have no idea. Anyway, this is the big highway that splits the old map. I don't see anything over there. I see, like, a cabin over there. But I see good stuff over here, so let's go. This is probably the direction I want to go in anyway, because I have a very specific location in mind. I'm not going to go too crazy with looting, but there are certain things I would really like to find. All right, let's just put this down. There we go. All right, we might as well talk about vehicles. All right, you might notice as I look at this vehicle, it's got shadow images of tires. So if I came over here and I had a tire, I could attach the tire right there. I could attach a tire right there. If I open up the front, oh, it has a battery. I'll have to remember that. Uh, I would do the same thing with an engine. Now, this one over here, you could also have this as a vehicle, too. Same thing. Do you have anything in here? No, you don't. Um, oh, you have a tire. All right, so if you wanted to use this vehicle, right, and you had three tires on it, you could just take this one off and put it onto this. The thing is that I might as well just demonstrate it. All right, so this is going to take 30 minutes in-game. I got to watch out because we might get a miss sometimes. When you're doing something that takes a long time, it can be dangerous if a miss shows up. Now, you might notice that I'm carrying this. Yeah, these things do not go in your uh, inventory anymore. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put this over here. Yeah, if I look at this, the only option that I have is to carry it. 
So if I had a vehicle on the other side of the map and I needed a tire and I knew it was here, I'd have to walk all the way over here and then carry it all the way back by hand. Now, we saw there was a battery here. I'm pretty sure I can put the battery in my inventory. But if there was an engine here, let's say there was an engine and a tire, and you needed them. You walk all the way back over here, you pick up the tire, you walk all the way back, then you walk all the way over here, you go get the engine, and you walk all the way back with it in your hands. Yeah, that's a little bit on the tedious side, you know? So I really wish the developer hadn't done that, but you know, it is what it is. All right, now let's get back to looting and the important things all right so antibiotics i'm i'll take the rags for now but antibiotics not so bad uh painkillers are better okay i have a hard hat and i do believe that's the only thing i'm wearing at the moment here hold on a minute uh where is it equipment yeah check out those abs all right so obviously i need clothing i'm not really sure why i don't have clothing but i don't all right so this looks like some kind of a food place so let's see if we can get some food, salt. I'm just going to leave things that I know I don't need for now because I don't have a lot of carry space. Like, for instance, mustard and a plate and ketchup and more salt, bottles. All right, one thing that I will take is, yes, I will take your coins. There's only one coin there, though. All right, and I think these are cabinets. Scissors. Yeah, I'll leave the scissors for now. A water container. I'll absolutely take that. Another water container. Oh, this is good. Okay, uh, the sugar and that'll wait. And I'll take the components. They stack up to eight. All right, and I don't think there's anything else in here. We have a bathroom. And we have a bathroom. All right, so we're out of here. I'm really counting on this thing. But in the meantime, let me drop some stuff off here. All right, why don't you... I'll keep one of those. Keep that. Actually, antibiotics, I don't need to be carrying them. Here, I'll put that in there for now. All right, is there anybody home? See, there could be a zombie walking around there, and maybe if he was upstairs, I would hear him growling. I'm not hearing that, so I guess I'm safe for now. All right, so you'll notice that I got a coin. The only use I have found for the coins are this. And then a soda. That's the only um, use I found. All right, now let's see. Can we get... I already have soda and I have water. I need food. Okay, I see canned fruit. I don't see anything else. I see batteries. We'll hold on to the batteries for now. Yeah, there's a lot of soda here. Oh, and there's also a filter. So that's a good thing in case you run into poison gas. Is there anything else here? You got any more coins? All right, we have more coins. There we go, one more coin. All right, how are we doing? All right, let's go upstairs and hopefully... Oh, was there a back room? Yeah, I just noticed there was a back room. Okay, so what... Oh, what do we have here? A propane bottle. Okay. And all right, we got an axe. I'll take the axe. What is this? A propane... Fill propane bottle. Q. Oh, transfer gas. Okay, so I'm taking the propane gas from there and I'm putting it into there. I'm guessing that's going to be for something new. Okay, I see it going down, so I'll come back and I'll get my bowel when it's full. All right, let's go upstairs. Okay, why would there be a glass door upstairs? I don't understand this. I mean, there's no reason for that. Oh my! I see cabinets, file cabinets. I'm very happy with that. Very happy indeed. All right, let's take a quick look here. Um, I'm going to leave that there. Okay, we got some good stuff here, including 9mm and a revolver. I'm going to have to carry those with me. Here, you take that for now, and you take that. And what else do we have? Nothing there. All right, let's check this one out. And check this one out. Uh, put this in here for the moment. And this one over here. Ooh! And I do have revolver ammo. Where is it? I have three shots. And we got some food here. This is a good thing. All right, now let's check this one out. Nothing there. All right, I got some shotgun shells. Very good. And all right, a lot of places to search. But here is the most important part. Here, put that over there. Keep that there. I'll keep, I'll keep, uh, put the water over here for now. 
Right. I only need one source of food at the moment. I'll just have that one. All right. Shotgun shells. And we'll put that over there. Here's the thing. Yeah, I can carry this around with me. And I will be back for those other ones, that's for sure. All right, let's get this outside, and I'll do some more uh, stuff. All right, now where was the box? Did I have anything in there? Yes, I did. Water. Okay, it's looking a little dark. I mean, it is 9.13 in the morning, so yeah, you got to keep your eyes open. All right, so this is what I'm going to be using to transport things. Uh, oh, yeah, the revolver ammo. Got to remember that. You put that there. We'll put that over there. Uh, antibiotic. Put the antibiotic over there. All right, that'll do for... I only need one of these. Here, put the bottle away. I'll keep the, uh, the soda. And I'll also put that over there, too. All right, so I'm going to be carrying that around with me. And I will be back for the other ones. But we had other rooms up here to search. And so far, this place has turned out to be amazing. All right, I have another glass door. What do we have here? Oh, what do you got? No, it's nothing. Okay, a baseball bat. I'll take the baseball bat. Could be useful. Um, carbon arrows. Oh, those are arrow shafts, I think. Yeah, that's an arrow shaft. Okay, but it is carbon now and not carbon. So it's good to see the R there. Okay, so uh, I would need to get heads on those, but that's good. Okay, we got some scrap metal. All right, nowhere near as good as the other room. What is this? Garden soil. Well, I'm not going to do that right now. Ooh, what is this? What is this? What is this? Revolver ammo. Which does remind me. We're full. Okay, that's going to give us options. All right, one more room. Does this open? Yes, it does. Okay, I got some scrap. Oh, I got another one of those. We'll search that. Is there anything around here that's just a plate? All right, what do we got in here? Um, rifle ammo, and some more components. Is there anything else? I'm guessing that means I can break that down. It's got like a little axe thing on there, but I don't think I need that just yet. All right, we will be coming back eventually. All right, let's head back downstairs, and let's start moving along here. First things first. All right, let's see. You can have that, and you can have that. And we'll put this over here. And we'll put that over there. And I'm only filling up one drawer, too. You know what I mean? Here, I'll put the baseball bat down there. Okay, so let's just go. We're going to... I see there's another building up here. All right, right there. Pick that up. Let's go. And I'll remember there's a tire and there's also a battery. We're going to have to identify what vehicle we we do want to uh, to use. And then, of course... We're going to have to get the materials for it. All right, so why don't you sit right here and then... Oh, I just found the vehicle that I want. The red pickup truck. Okay, the red pickup truck. This is the vehicle that I want. Oh, and there's a tire. Should I just attach a tire now? All right, we don't need to. We know there's a battery down there. We know there's a tire down there. We know there's a tire here. So that's what's important. Do you have anything like an engine? No, you don't. That would have been really nice. Okay, so I think... Do you have gas? This gas? You have no gas. Okay, that's a problem. We would need a container. And we need it not to bug out. Give me that. Is this open? Why would this be open like this? I mean... Did once upon a time people drive out that way? I mean, I don't... That looks like it's been that way for a long time. I don't know. Anyway, this is good. This is good. Um, oh, what is this? What is this? What is... Can I get over there, please? Can I get over this? Okay, up and down. Okay, more of that. Okay, what is this? Uh, vehicle parts scrap. Okay, can I make things with that? I'm guessing so. All right. By the way, is there anything in the glove com... Oh, there's no glove compartment. Never mind. All right, let's see. Oh, we got another machine over here. Oh, and we got coins. I will take the coins. Thank you. What do we have here? Batteries. I'll take them. Screwdriver can definitely be useful. And we got components. And I wouldn't be surprised if my inventory is nearly full. 
Right. I could also get another, um, another, what's it, a can of soda there. Ooh, 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 we got more clothing. More clothing. Uh, equip. Okay, so now I have a helmet, and of course I have a, uh, a raincoat. Don't I look awesome? Do I actually see that? Okay, that's pretty good. I'm pretty sure I need 762 for that, but that's nice. Okay, does this open? Okay, and a bandage. All right, I dropped the bandage on the ground. All right, let's go back to the uh, the file cabinet and drop some cool stuff off here. All right, I think we're going down here now. All right, we'll drop this off and the shotgun shells and the screwdriver and more of these. And, of course, the... Uh, Vehicle parts scraps, and then we'll put this over here too, and the batteries. Right, did I put the coins in the first one? Yes, I did. I, do, I don't think I need more drinks. I think I'm doing pretty good with the drinks at the moment. Am I thirsty? No, I mean, I'm really thirsty right now, so I don't really think it's a problem. All right, let's just check out the rest of this place. Let's keep the door closed just in case. All right, we searched this area, and we'll close this door Two. Oh, can we not close that door? Lovely, lovely, lovely. All right, I think that goes just outside, even though it doesn't open. Was there? Oh, yeah, right. That's what I wanted. Give me that. Then I can put that over here. There we go. I would like more revolver ammo. That would be good. What is that? Oh, it's a bottle. All right, what do we got? Is this openable? Yes, it is. Oh, we got uh, beef cans. Very nice. What do you got? Okay, there's a cigarette there. All right, th I saw there were some drawers back there, so we're going to check those out. Okay, so we have a knife. Is that something? Lots of bottles lying around. Anything there? All right, so let's open these up. Um, rifle ammo. Now, that isn't the um, for the one we just... Actually, it says M4, doesn't it? All right, we'll, we'll, we'll check it out. All right, and this one right here. Okay, so we got some more 9mm. We got a hammer, and we got some more shotgun shells. A shotgun would have been nice, just saying. All right, I saw some more drawers over here. Okay, we got duct... Okay, more shotgun shells. All right, duct tape. I probably want the duct tape. You know, I am actually getting a little thirsty, so I'm going to drink this. All right, and we'll just take the duct tape and we'll bring that out to the vehicle. Uh, did I search this one? Sewing kit. All right, well, you know what? Let's drop this stuff into the, um, the filing cabinet. I am starting to run out of room. But, you know, I searched everything else. I wouldn't want to eliminate that as something, a place to search in the future. Do I want to... Here, hold it a second. Take the baseball bat out. Put this in. Is this... Where is, where's the ammo? Yeah, the rifle ammo. I think that might just do it. Hold on a second. Oh, that is the right one. Okay, that could be useful. I will keep an eye on that for the future. For now, we'll keep that out. Did I have any more ammo up here? Yes, I did. Okay, and I might... I, I should keep them together. Yeah, keep that all together. All right, and we go back up here because apparently I had some more space up here. Uh, take that. And I don't need two of these. All right, I'll hold on to the 9mm. You know what? I'll put the 9mm away. If I, get, if I get a pistol, I'll get a pistol, right? All right, let's do this again. And then let's load that up. And I couldn't help but notice that there was a, uh, a mist. Yeah, I think we're going to go inside, and I'm going to hide upstairs. Oh, I didn't see that. I think I'm going to go inside, and I'm going to hide upstairs. Yeah, I can't close that door, can I? No, I can't. All right, I think as long as I'm up here, and I close the door, there shouldn't be any real problems. All right, so fortunately, I have a nice bed. So let's sleep for one hour, which I don't think is going to be enough, by the way. But we'll just do that for now.
All right, I hear spooky music, which means they're walking around there. Can I see one of them? All right, I'm just going to sleep for another hour because there's no purpose in not doing that. One, I get some rest, and two, yeah, I mean, I want them gone. I was trying to see one because the thing is that when the mist ends, they kind of die, but I have a feeling that if you don't actually see one, none of them die. There's no one to die if you can't see them, you know? If you saw one walking around here and then you went to uh, sleep for another hour, if you looked out here, you'd probably see a smoking remain. And you might be able to go over and loot it. All right, is there anything over here? Okay, more vehicle parts. More of that. Ah, concrete slab. I'm going to leave those for now. Uh, I'll just remember where they are. Oh, we got some more propane. Oh, that reminds me. Oh, did I leave that back there? Yeah, the propane can. All right, at the moment, I don't need it. And I know where it is, so it shouldn't be a problem. All right, let's just drop off these last couple of items here. Okay, that stacks, I guess. And then we have some of that. Do I... Okay, that's actually a better knife. Hold on a minute. Can, can you... Oh, I'm holding it. Never mind. Let's try that again. Put this one here. Put this one here. And now down to here. And put that in there. Okay, no, no, not what I wanted. It'll do. Actually, you know... The axe is probably... You know, I got two guns. It doesn't make it matter. All right, so let's keep going. So at this point, I just want to get to where I'm going. And I will be back for those other file cabinets because these things are great for storage, aren't they? All right. Uh, by the way, that's probably good. That is a placeholder right there. Um, previously, I have gone through that, and there's nothing there. So, in the future, maybe they will itemize it or something like that. And as a matter of fact, all the vehicles that are next to it are just basically for show. See, if you go over here, there's nothing. You can't even break it apart or anything like that. Hey, tire! No, there isn't. So, this is basically all just for show. Although, this one here looks like it shouldn't be. But it is. So that's a thing. All right, we got another gas station coming up. Okay, is this police car good? No, it is not. All right, but I do believe I see another one. Okay, this... Okay, and all of a sudden... I was thinking, hey, this has got two tires. No, it doesn't. But it seems to have one. Okay, so that is another tire we have available to us. You have an engine? No, you don't. All right, uh, why don't we put this down for the moment? Here, go over here. Boom, there we go. All right, um, let's... Oh, uh, another baseball bat. All right, first of all, do you have anything? Oh, ooh, you have a shirt. I will equip that shirt. Okay, so we have 9 millimeter. We have shotgun shells. A suppressor. Okay, what is the suppressor for? Okay, and we got 762. I'm guessing that's for the AK. And how are we doing with thirst and hunger? I guess we're doing okay for now. All right, how about um, glove compartment? I'll take the can. All right, I won't take the pencil. I did take the pencil. Ugh, can I put the pencil back? There we go. Not sure why I took that. Okay, so there's another, another tire over here. So I think we have three then, right? So I would need to mostly locate an engine. Then I can just walk back there. Maybe there's an engine in there. All right, let's just check out. What do you got? Uh, okay, you got that, and you got another uh, revolver. I will put that in here. Okay, is the second one full? Nearly. Put that there. Put that there. The 9 millimeter. we're keeping that in the first one. Uh, we'll put a can over there. Hold on a minute. Right, that's where the 9 millimeter is. I'm doing... Oh, you know what? I didn't... Put this over here. There we go. And then I have uh, more ammunition. So I'm going to the third drawer now. That's why these things are wonderful. And they have such a, a huge amount of space. 
I will be back for all of those. Okay, uh, do you have a glove compartment? No, you don't. All right, well, I mean, you don't have anything that I want. Was there anything else in here? No, there wasn't. All right, so do you have anything around here? I don't know, like a backpack or a, um, okay, I'll take that. A backpack or a, um, an engine or something like that? Because I don't see anything. By the way, it does get choppy because it is in no way, shape, or form um, optimized. So get used to that idea. All right. So we got some lashings and we got the other one. What's that? Okay, that's clay. Yeah, you hear the growling? Yeah, somebody's in there. Yep, somebody's in there. All right. Here's a question. Do I need to go in there? I mean, there's probably food in there, but it, I'm not dying for food at the moment, right? Okay, lashing. Anything else here? Yeah, there's somebody in there, so we're not going to worry too much about that. What is that? Oh, that's more vehicle scrap. Oh, and we have another vehicle to look at, too. Uh, do you have a... Uh, you do not have an engine. And do you have any wheels? You have one wheel. Okay, so we have all four wheels for the red wagon down there. Let me just pop in here for a moment. Well, we don't have an engine. I think that's the only thing we're missing at this point is an engine. So we're going to have to keep our eyes open for an engine. They're fairly close to each other, too. We did search you, right? Yeah, we did search you. All right. And I do have some more of this. Okay, where did I put those? First things first. Fill that. And fill that. Did I? I think I picked some lashings up, didn't I? I don't see them. All right, put the uh, shotgun ammo over there. Yeah, I would really like to get a shotgun. That'd be awesome. Right up here. And then we'll go to the last drawer. See, I can't do a lot more looting. Oh, I actually do have a stack of those, don't I? Okay, lashing. And we'll put that there. And I have extra revolver ammo. I have one. That'll do the job. All right, I am hungry, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to have the um, the fruit can. Because I think that'll give me some um, thirst, too. Right, okay, so let me just check this one. Yeah, yeah, I thought there was a stack there. All right, let me just look around inside. Maybe we could get lucky with that. There's no zombie here, right? No. Okay, there's another battery here. All right, I'm gonna let I'm gonna let it sit there for now. Can I see what it is? I guess when I pick it up, I'll see what kind of percentage it is. We'll pick the best one that we have. But again, without an engine. Yeah, yeah, he's in there. All right. I I don't see a reason to go in there at this point. Because, you know, he'll just respawn, and I don't need anything in there. It's probably food. Mechanical repairs. It's probably, like, food and stuff like that. I, w I don't think you'd see it, um... I don't think you'd see a, um, an engine in there or anything like that. All right, so let's just grab this and continue. Boom. Going down the road. Because there's something I am looking for. Oh, wait a minute. If my memory is right, this T over here, one goes up to a forest area that has those godless killing machines. The other has bandits. Yeah, I see somebody walking around over there. Okay. I have had some experience with the bandits, and they didn't seem to be quite functioning properly. I was able to, like, shoot them in the face from really close. But, you know what? I'm just not going to risk that right now because I'm actually... I have a lot, and I just... I need to move along. I can visit them another time. Because, like I said, I think that's one of the things that isn't quite working is, you know, I kind of shot one... And the other guys ran over and were kind of like holding guns, but they weren't shooting. And then they let me shoot them in the face, you know? They were very polite, though, I'll say that. 
Okay, I don't think this is a real vehicle. No, it is not. This also is not a real vehicle. No, 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 no. Okay, what I'm looking for should be coming up here on the left very soon. And it's fairly easy to see. Okay, what do we got over here? Okay, we, okay, you know what? Put this down. Okay, I see components. Okay, engine, please. No, no engine. More components. I don't see anything else in there. All right, anything over here? Hmm. Why would somebody build this? Is there a reason? I mean, do, near a shore, yes. You know, to protect from flooding. Why would somebody build this here? Okay, what do we got? Do we have anything good? Okay, computer. I guess I can scrap that. Right. Oh, does this openable? All right, shotgun shells, or maybe one shotgun shell. And that's about it. Otherwise, complete waste of time. But I mean, I guess I could come back and scrap some stuff there, right? All right, let's just go. All right, where? Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Is anything else scattered around here? All right, let's go. And let me see about putting some stuff in here. All right, you, oh, I actually have a full stack there, don't I? Um, am I down there? There we go. And while I was up there, I should have done this. I wish I had a shotgun. Nice uh, pump shotgun, you know what I mean? But, you know, I don't accept the double barrel. I would. God, what century is this from? All right, now I believe that I should start seeing over here. See, there's a checkpoint up here. I don't know if there's going to be um, bandits there or anything. But, yes! White House! For those who uh, played the uh, previous versions of this game, the White House was a wonderful place to set up shop. And that is what I'm going to do for now. What? 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 Did, did, did anybody else see that? There, there was like a... There was, an, there was like an ATV there. And then it was gone. Why, why is it gone? I saw an ATV. There was an ATV there and now it's gone. Why is it gone? Is it in there? No? Oh. Okay, let's, uh, let's set up shop. All right, close that door. All right, first things first. Let's just put this... Yeah, I mean, I didn't mean to throw it. Let's try that again. All right, and we'll put this like here. Boom. Right, so we got a lot of supplies in here already. So that's the reason I want the other ones. Uh, I'm hoping, though, we can get the, uh, the pickup truck going so that we can do something with that. All right, is that openable? Now, do these have anything in them? I right, see there's a lot of drawers here. They're really small, but, you know, they can be useful. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything, so I'm guessing that's the way that is. That there's just nothing over here. All right, how about up here? Right, I mean, it is storage space. That's what's important here, right? Uh, not as good as uh, one of those, and we already know where we can get two more. So I will absolutely be doing that. All right, we have anything over here? Yeah, this window could be an issue. Just saying. Uh, but it really depends on whether they know I'm here or not. All right. See, you can actually board these windows up and such. All right. Okay, I guess those are just destroyable things, where you can get materials from destroying them. Okay, there's no drawers there. So there's no loot here that I am seeing. Okay, we got that. No. Okay, so there's nothing in there. Okay, a nice bathroom. Okay, we do have some uh, powder detergent. 
Do we have anything in there? Nope. All right, just breakables. And finally, the master bedroom. Oh, there's a drawer. Maybe we can get something in the drawer. No, it's nothing good in the drawer. Drawers over here. Yeah, I guess it's just programmed not to have any loot in here. I guess maybe because the house was never really lived in, so there wouldn't be anything. But that's good because there's no, there's not a lot of clutter around here, you know? There's a lot of space. And I have a bed upstairs already. Oh, and guess what we can do? We can make this our base, and that is exactly what I'm going to do. Boom. Um, room selection. Make this my active base. Boom, done. All right, so there is my active base right now. Um, hopefully we won't get any mists in the future. I mean, if I'm sleeping, they really shouldn't uh, come by. You know, there used to be, is this the same one? In the old map, there was... Oh, I can't do that. Darn. There was a tall place. Uh, I don't think it was quite this in the previous version. And a lot of times, there was body armor up above, you know? Oh. Okay, so we have a fuel can. Here's the thing. I ran into... Oh, it's got fuel in it. Very nice. Uh, here's the thing. I ran into a bug where I was trying to put fuel in, take fuel out of a vehicle, and it got stuck, and I had to, like, exit the game and come back in, and I lost the, uh, the fuel container. So if I do that, I'm going to save beforehand to see if I can prevent bugs, if you know what I mean. All right, I don't see anything in here. Uh, previously, I would put the workbench there in a previous playthrough. Anyway, I think that uh, we're good to go for now. This was my goal for today, was to get over here. I think what we're going to do in the future, uh, the next episode, if you guys want to see more, is that there is a, um, there's a checkpoint over there. And I'm kind of hoping I can get some maybe gun upgrades. Maybe there's some vehicles. We saw a lot of vehicles. Maybe one of them will have an engine. If I can just get an engine, then we can get the, uh, the big red truck working for us there. And maybe we can load up all of the file cabinets because I know that there is other ones. Oh, yes. More like this, please. I mean, look at all that storage right there. And I could probably put them on top of each other, too. That'd be awesome. Anyway, that's going to be it for now. If you want to see more of this, please give the video a like. Maybe say something in the comments for the Great God Algorithm. And, of course, subscribing is a great way to show your support. And if anybody, if everybody just joins in prayer, maybe that ATV will reappear. Yeah, I don't know what happened with that. It's very sad. I'm guessing it's somewhere else on the map and the game just updated as soon as I got over here. It's still very, very sad. So thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it. And play games because games are fun. And then it started raining. See ya.